So perfect square concept. Now the idea is that what is a square number? For example, 1, 4, 9, 16, 25, 36, all these are perfect square numbers which has got the square root as a pure positive integer. So perfect square concept, I would like to tell that if you look at the total factors of these number, for example, 16, how many factors are there? How many divisors are there? 1, 2, 4, 8 and 16, which are 5. Let's take a number 25. 1, 5 and 25, which is 3. So let's take the number 36. The factors are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 9, 12, 18 and 36. So these are 9 factors of 36. So all these numbers are odd numbers. The concept is the perfect square number will always always have the total factors as odd. If a number is not a perfect square, the total factors of that number will always be even. That is the concept of perfect square. On this, a very beautiful question can be asked. There are 100 rooms and there are 100 students. Each student goes to all the rooms which are multiples of those students. For example, 1 will go to all the rooms, 2 will go to all the even numbers, 3 will go to the 3 multiples which are 3, 6, 9, 12 and they will always keep on changing the condition of the room. Earlier all the 100 rooms are open. Student number 1 will go to all the rooms and close it. Student number 2 will go to all the even numbers and again open it and so on and on. So now after all the 100 students have performed the operation, how many rooms will be closed and how many rooms will be open? A very very good conceptual x cat question. So this is, it was hard to believe but this is based on the direct application of what we learnt as perfect square concept. If you take any room number, the people who will go at that room will be the factors of that number. So at room number 12, the people who will go at room number 12 are student number 1, 2, 3, 4, 6 and 12. All the factors. Point number 2, if at any room even number of people are going, the room will remain open as it is. And if at any room odd number of people are going, the performance or the operation is done odd number of times, the room will be closed. So clubbing the both things, the room numbers who have got a total factors as odd will be closed. And the rooms which have got their total factors as even will be open. So we learned that the numbers who have got total factors as odd are perfect square numbers. So in other words, all the perfect square from 1 to 100 will be closed and the remaining are open. There are 10 numbers which are perfect square numbers from 1 to 100, 1 square, 2 square till 10 square. And so 10 rooms are closed and 90 rooms are open. A very very important conceptual concept called perfect square concept.